I don't have the shard on. Oh, wait, I do have the shard on me. Just a second. Uh, let's see. Yeah, close enough. Just a second. Go for it. Okay, first one locked. And coming. Second one locked. And they're both coming because the first one teleported into the path. That one. Yes, that's a present. And an ender pearl. Go for it. The other one was a cheapskate, though. So what's that shard up to now? 388. That's an overflow chest. So if we build too much humus, it should go in there. And that 37 uh, rubber wood was there before. Okay. Now, I'm watching the pipes, and even if they're back flowing, I um, can still... What? Okay, I was just looking here. This is mostly the same system that was there before. So, so long as the... Uh, Oh, it should still be outputting. We would kill that chest and the pipe associated with it. Okay. That's the most adjustment I've made. But we should still otherwise be seeing stuff flowing through here. Was that you getting a multiple of five or me? I think it was me, but I don't know what I did to get the multiple of five. I'm just standing there watching, and then all of a sudden, ding, ding, ding. Ah, uh, I see the problem. Oh. Logs come out of the logger on the sides. That shouldn't matter, because this yes, thing Yes, it was, does. This thing was working before. But okay. Uh, could we get a diamond pipe? Because I... Because if I'm going to restructure this, I want it to at least restructure it right. Right there. Yeah, and some of them are going to backflow, but I got the Yellow one, I'm going to put uh, levers. That prevents anything from flowing into it. Yep. Gonna put that chest into the floor here. Alright. And that should act as the proper overflow. Ah, uh, yeah. so I'll stash the humus we already have in there. I have a lot of rubber wood that must have backflowed. But yeah, now, now that's better. That's better. You're actually seeing it come down? Yeah. Okay, it's a... Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay, this stone pipe here, 
that's just above the chest. Yeah. I need something to remove dirt and only dirt from that chest. From this one? Yeah. And basically put it into that diamond pipe. Hmm. And, yeah, I think dirt and sand, actually. Either... So what I have there is rudimentary at best. Okay. So I might need to tear it down. What the, how many uh, ender kills do we have? We have 388. Nice. And I just put the stack of portable tanks on top of the exi the main tanks there, and there you go. Hmm. It goes all the way up a couple of floors. Yeah. I find it easier to deal with now to be that way. You check it on the tank down here? Yeah, quarter tank. Yep. This is the next floor I'm going to deal with the lighting issue. Also, we need to come up with a, a, a something for this room so we can finally put the Zycraft bricks into the floor. Yeah. Uh, once I get the other ones ready, that one's going to look pretty odd standing out like that. Yep. Uh, after I straighten that floor out, it's time to work on the main floor. Because, or the ground floor, I should say. Oh? Uh, we already have two rooms, actually all three rooms in use. We, we just gotta pick out the colors for them, for the ground floor. I was uh, off work again today. Oh. I've been waking up with, but still with headaches and nausea. So uh, I'm having blood work done. You just have no luck at all. No, I don't. Do you know what they think it is, possibly? Mm, worse than you already have? They're assuming that my pancreatitis may be making a return. Uh. Yeah. There's no proof yet, that's why I just went for blood work. But given my history, they'd rather play it safe than sorry. Yeah. All things considered, doing blood work is a small price to pay, to be sure. Because mm. if they catch it early, they can fix it. And I've rethought about the whole uh, mess about using uh, the uh, nether brick for the fencing. Okay. And I think that's what I'm going to go with. Cool. One sec. I had to drop Minecraft sound down to 2% because the stupid rain. Why is this sound much louder than this sound? Minecraft sound don't make any sense. I was looking at 
automation situation with uh, uh, most of the stuff. And yeah, Red Powered is going to have to play, play a larger part once we start getting farther. Okay. Or, 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 or sorry, Red Power, I mean, is going to get farther. Brain no worky. Sharpness for... Okay, I just made one that had a combination that I don't really like. It had Knockback 2, Bane of Arthropods 5 on a Nathane. Bane of Arthropods, not so good. What a waste. I combined it with the Ender Ender. Bane of Arthropods goes away. Everything else stays. Yeah. Downside? I'm ten levels short. What do you mean ten levels short? In order to actually make the combine? Uh, put it in the anvil. If you walk away with it in the anvil, what will stay in the anvil? I don't think so. Okay, put it in my chest here uh, at the bottom left or bottom right somewhere. And I'm level 10, so... No, I need 10 more. I'm what at level have? 18. So you need level 28? Yes. Why not just make a whole blinking new one? <laughs> because the idea of having those combined amuses me too much. What are you doing down there? Mining some coal that was in the wall to get some of the experience I'm going to need. Just remember to either light it up and, or fill it back in. Or we'll have a monster spawner inside. Admittedly, this is while on my way to go to the Nether. See if I can find another one of the, another couple of those big resource nodes. Because those things are, are just nuts for actual experience output. Hmm. How's the quarry doing? It's been off for a bit. Well, don't we still need ten? Yeah. It should be getting down to the right layer about now, shouldn't it? Uh, it's getting there, as far as I know. I just haven't been there in a while because it hasn't had storage for it. Well, I've been thinking 
I'm probably, more than probably, I think, going to regret actually putting this on the table. But I, what I think might be an idea would be to actually surround our base with the, uh, uh, with the mining, like the quarry mining. Oh god. So we have the whole, a uh, big hole all around the base, and then a simple bridge out. I know that sounds risky, but it would definitely deal with the security issues that we've been having. Yeah. Although we would have to sacrifice the ravines. All things considered, it's just the resource we'd be getting anyway. Yep. But we'd still have to come up with an automated processing. Yeah. There's just no two ways about it, regardless of how we're going to look at it. Yep. And I'm thinking about, like, I don't know if you caught my messages about it, but I was thinking about using Railcraft loop lines in between floors for some things. I can't really comment on Railcraft loop lines because I don't really have much in the way of experience regarding it. Because you haven't even played it with Railcraft in creative mode. Right. You're in the nether, right? Yep. Okay, it's currently night, so I'm going to sleep that off. Cool. And that was you dinging. That was me getting 20... That was 25. Oh, a couple suicidal zombies. They thought the sun was a good place for them. Hmm. I'm only going to start switching one wall here. Just to see what it looks like? Yeah. Do you want me to blast it through some more nether rack while I'm at while I'm down here and, and just get some to put in the compressor? Uh, up to you. I'm not sure how much nether wreck we, uh, we currently have. I'm not sh exactly sure either. I was pointed into a cave. You, you can guess what my panic reaction was to that fireball. Shoot it back? Well, considering I didn't know which direction it came from, I ducked into the hole. Ah. I just gotta track down our nether brick fences. Okay, we got 46 stacks of a nether rack. So I don't think we specifically need more. If you want to gather more because you want to gather more, that's fine. But I don't think you should go out of your way to gather a pile.
coming back at level 29 with a supply of, stu of supplies. Um, out uh, in front of the castle here. And? I have mixed feelings about it. On the one hand, it just doesn't look bad. On the other hand, I don't know. I guess it just doesn't seem to quite match with the castles the way I I feel about it. Like the the cobble uh, was fun thing because it actually was somewhat natural looking, right? Yeah. I think you should take a look. I do kind of like it, but sometimes my ideas on what I like and what I don't don't exactly uh, match what everybody else would think. The color difference is definitely jarring from grass to that. Yeah, it's less so with the cobble. Yeah. Don't worry, only players can get through that gap. Yep. And being up towards this way reminds me. So what do you think overall? Like, I know it's kind of jarring, but at the same point, it looks a lot more built. A lot more fortressy. Yeah. Oh, by the way, there are bees up here. Rock it, bees? Yep. Yay. In the one that I have open. That's good. That'll help. Because it, uh, I don't know if I, how much I mentioned this before, but it takes a lot of uh, generations working in tandem. A lot of different reading attempts to get it to go right. They up the difficulty a bit. What difficulty do you actually have it on the server? Uh, I haven't actually checked what breeding difficulty it's set at. Okay, it's probably normal then. Uh, one thing about the bees uh, is that the the type uh, that they put out, the uh, number of offspring, it used to be uh, that that, that the uh, one offspring, if I recall correctly, was uh, recessive. Okay. So once, once you got, got a dominant trait mixing with it, it was relatively easy to, uh, to switch it over. 
it's now dominant. Oh, lovely. So what that effectively means is for your first generation, you're wiser to uh, I can see a rock beehive from here. Excuse me. You're diving down for it? I gotta get my uh, scoop. But yes. But yeah, so it is a lot harder now than it was before. Do you see the hive I was talking about? No, nope, I'm not looking for it though. Is it in... Is it in the wall or is it in the floor? In the floor. If it's in the floor of this quarry, it'll be picked up automatically. Actually, it got um, picked up. Where's my scoop? Um. Um, what? In the short time that I've had this quarry turned back on, it has picked up two rock hives. Oh, that's good. I won't bother then. And, and you don't need to bother at all when they're in the floor. Uh, in the floor of I the know, quarry. It's the walls. I know, OCD. They will gather themselves. Yes, get the viewers get to see my ugly mug shot now. Oh, you're not streaming. Yeah, I am. Oh, I'm not doing too bad. Stop, because I got your channel up and it doesn't show anything. Ah, uh, there it is. And I'm muting my uh, side here. Yeah. I think those two canvas bags I had made that time are gone. No, it's... He's asking if it's single player. No, it's not single player. It is multiplayer, closed server, whitelist, yada, yada, yada. Uh, 